Hello everyone, and welcome back to Let's Play The Sims 4 Snowy Escape. So, <laughs> it's been six months since the last part of this. I don't have an explanation, because I honestly don't remember why I stopped uploading it. I even made it private for a while. But a couple weeks ago I was thinking about how I needed a Let's Play to take me up until Cottage Living came out, or comes out. Because obviously we finished Dream Home Decorator, and I know I still have The Sims 2, but we're going through that so quick, and, I and like, we're about to be on the fourth expansion pack before we even hit the one year mark, because we just finished Open for Business last week, and I decided to do a Paranormal Let's Play, which we did. We did three parts of that last week. That's been done, happened, over with. It was fun actually playing with that pack because I didn't get to back in January. And I needed another one because I knew that wouldn't, I knew Paranormal wouldn't take a very, a very long time to get through. So I thought, why don't I bring back Snowy Escape? Again, I have no idea why I stopped doing Snowy Escape. I really enjoyed it. So you might have noticed that I've made parts one and two public again because this is part three and I updated the thumbnails to match the ones that I am now doing. I think I did that around the time that I updated the eco lifestyle thumbnails. So anyway, <laughs> um, this is the exact same save file that I've played Dream Home Decorator in as well as, oh my god, they had their babies. Okay. Dream Home Decorator and also Paranormal. Oh, and this is happening, the Sims Session Festival. Uh, this is a special event that's happening currently in the game. We might check that out. It's a lot of copywritten music, so I mean, I don't rely on my channel for any source of income, so we could go check that out, but it's not a necessity right now. Um, so I've gone through and done everything again basically. I've put all, placed all the lots. Uh, this family are back at their vacation. This family live down here again. We have the romantic interest of Kyoko. Um, Alexa. Again, I'm sorry. This is probably one of the reasons I stopped this Let's Play because I named the kid Alexa and even mine's going off. I didn't have one by the time this ended. But my Alexa's going off. So, but I named the kid Alexa. And I that was a big mistake. So that was probably one of the reasons <laughs> I ended it. But I replaced the climbing gym. So yeah. So we've got all of this. Because we didn't explore like any of the world. So we're just going to go back with Kyoko and Chiyoko. I built them a new house. Because the house I built back in November was god awful. And it wasn't very Japanese at all. Obviously, I used the new build mode items, but I, I built a more traditional Japanese house for them. You know, it's still like a really small lot, so there wasn't much room, but I follow followed a floor plan online and when this actually loads, there we go, we'll be able to see it. I don't know why she's getting into- oh, okay. Story time. Um, their pet, show has actually gone missing. And I don't know why. <laughs> oh my god, Yamachan. I haven't seen him in so long. Well, I did have a glitch uh, not too long ago that he was just showing up at my, my, my sim's apartment. I remember tweeting about it. I was playing a current household, which I no longer have. But I do remember tweeting about it, that Yamachan would just show up at my Sims apartment. Oh, I completely forgot. So, Kyoko has now has been promoted to level three of the salary person career. I don't really care too much about the career because she is a, oh, we've done a lot of this. Okay, I don't have any of my mods because there was just an update. We're going to have to do a lot of this again. 
which is fine. I can just kind of do that now, just so we get that done. I meant to uh, look at what stage of this aspiration we were actually in, because basically I don't have the original save file anymore, so I had to redo everything. <laughs> but anyway, this is their new house. They have quite a big house. It's very closed floor plan because a lot of traditional Japanese homes are obviously still using the foundation tool. Well, no, the, the platform tool, I mean. And the, it's set back. I'm watching them. Or I've told you to. Then she kind of has a bit of an interest in this guy. They're, they're lovebirds. They're co-workers. You know, that he has a key to their house. And they're, like, really good friends. But I'm pretty sure I said it like, like they were childhood friends or something. But she needs some fun. So we're going to take her and Hayashi on a date. So I'm going to have her change her outfit. I forget the walk-in wardrobe doesn't actually let you change her outfit. So I'm going to have her change into her regular every day. And they're going to just go out on a little date to the bar. Because I never went to the bar. I still have not gone to it. So, you know, it's been a long time coming that I'm actually going back and going through all of this again. So, let's call him and ask him out. Can we... How do we ask out on a date? I don't... Is there somewhere to call... Oh, we're getting a phone call anyway. Oh! Oh, but it's a different bar. No, I'm alright. I don't want to go to the Elixir's... Feebly ask on date. There we go. So, Hayashi. Let's ask him on a date to the... I don't actually remember what the bar is called. I don't even remember who built it. I think it was Sin Lissy. It might have been. Um, here it is. The Izakaya. So, let's go over here. So, here we are. This is the Izakaya. So, you've got some card playing rooms. The bar over here. I believe there's some more tables upstairs. Oh no, there's a, just a private card table over here. And then there's the toilets. I don't know why this area is so big and open. But I do remember these tables being like the coolest thing. Because uh, they're just covered in stickers. Okay, and something cool is that our, our mixologist is actually one of the Snowy Escape trailer sims that... Max is uploaded and I placed in the world. So anyway, let's come sit together. I do believe that this is S pop, yep. Because they, they added that to the base game when Snowy Escape came out. Because it originally came with uh City Living. Oh and here is another one of the trailer sims. This is Tetsuya. He's on the cover. He's the snowboarding guy. So we're gonna order drink order drinks for group and we are going to order we can get fizzy fruity drink oh yeah and i forgot to say uh she likes fitness rock climbing skiing and snowboarding and s pop and japanese folk music because obviously we didn't have likes and dislikes oh it's lagging oh we're lagging great oh there we go we didn't have likes and dislikes back when this pack came out. Uh -huh. On oh, there's Jenna. Um, so I, I gave her those because she does like those and she is a extreme thought sport enthusiast. Oh, and here's another Sophia Rogers. Currently seeing no aliens because it, it's meant to be Aliens Night. So don't know what's going on there. Oh, and this is uh, Naoki. He lives in the house that we ruined in Dream Home Decorator. Just saying. So sorry, Kayla. Um, anyway, this is... I forget what this neighbourhood is actually called. Let me just look it up. Because I feel so dumb. Actually, it should be on here. Uh, learn about... I don't know. But it should, like, hold on. Because the neighborhood we live in is Wakaba. 
Uh, mount como como rebi This is the Sen Bamach this is a Sen Bamachi neighborhood. So we haven't actually been here yet. This is where the park is. And I believe this is where the Festival of Lights happens. So oh but the bar is becoming quite lively. We have Keiko over here. Spencer. Alright, okay. I don't know why. Sophia is piping up, so we're we're on a date. We're not having a very successful date, so we're gonna go sit together over here, just away from everyone else, just so they leave us alone, so we can ha enjoy our date in peace. And I'm gonna remove, I'm gonna remove this chair because we don't want someone else just randomly joining us out of the blue, because it'd be very weird. So go sit. Oh my god, why are you so cold? No, no, sit together. No, 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 sit together, please. Sit together. Come on, no. Hayashi. Come on. No. Hayashi, come sit down. Okay. Discuss past ski and pit experiences. Oh, no, okay. Get to know, come on. There we go, come sit down with us. I don't know why he's in his outerwear, but it's fine. So, friendly. Oh yeah, I completely forgot about lifestyle. So she's single and loving it, apparently. Which should hopefully change. So we have to tell him a story. Tell a funny story. And then we have to flirt with him, which is kind of hard because she is unflirty. So, let's do a couple of those. Oh no, that's mischievous. No. Romance. Um, ask completely inappropriate question. Uh, have 2D conversations with him, so friendly. Where is deep conversation, and then let's do another deep conversation, wherever that is. There we go. And we have to kiss him, which might be a bit hard, so let's try and find a bit more of a scenic location. So let's go here together, once we do this second deep conversation. So let's go to a more, you know, nice spot. And one thing I do like about them is their outerwear does kind of match. They both have this more, like, throwback 90s aesthetic to them. And she's really tired. So, we're gonna do our first kiss. Unflirty kiss. Oh, maybe they've already done their first kiss. No, Hayashi, stay here. I feel like they might have done their first kiss already. I don't remember. Oh, there we go. We've we've completed everything. So make funny faces. We could actually go on a hike. So learn about hiking. So actually, let's go see the festival schedule. So let's see when... Oh, we lost... Oh, no, we lost friendship. Okay. Let's go see when the festival is. There are numerous festivals. So the Festival of Light... Is every other Friday. The Festival of Snow is every other Saturday and then every other Sunday. Okay. We could go over here. So, over here. So, we could hike. Let's go do a hike of the scenic route with Hayashi. Because I feel like that would be kind of cute. She is very tired and she does have work in the morning. So she might miss work by oversleeping, but let's go on a hike, because I think this is another thing that I never did back in November. He's also feeling very dazed, so I'm not too sure what that's about. Why aren't they hiking? Go and hike. Hike scenic loop with Hayashi. Come on, there we go. 
No, are you not going to do it? Is there something wrong? Is hiking broken? Please tell me hiking's not broken. Because that's one of the nicest things. No, th these sims are hiking. Maybe we'll just have to hike another time. Maybe that's Kyoko saying that she wants to go home to go to bed. So we can <laughs> send her home. So we had a legendary date and there is something special in your sims inventory to help remember it. So that will just be the rose in the vase. Oh, and Sho has returned home, thankfully. So we can kind of be not so sad about that. So we're going to go straight to bed. Actually, we can take a bath and then go to sleep. Sho is home. So, Shioko. Oh, we need to bathe him, actually. Uh, come pet. Come and pet him. Where is that, like, creepy sound coming from? I don't know. Okay. But go pet sh little show over here. Oh, gone to sleep. Go wake up show. So you don't have to be sad anymore because he's right there. I don't know why he ran away. My pets always seem to run away in The Sims 4 with just no reason. Like, he has a full food bowl. He has a bed. He has various objects that he can stretch. Yeah, he was like, nah, you're not giving me enough attention. So I'm going to make you give me attention. <laughs> Come praise him. Thank him. Oh my god. Kyoko. Don't nap in the bath. Just go straight to bed, please. So, you don't need to go cry out. Go give... How do we bathe cats? I don't know. Go to sleep. And I will pick up in the morning. Okay, so today is actually the lottery, and Chiyoko is up bright and early, so she's going to come and prepare some breakfast. So serve breakfast. She's going to serve a breakfast scramble, and we are going to partake in the lottery. Have I ever won? No. But could today be our lucky day? It very well could. So, Kyoko is very hungry. So, I'm going to have her wake up, go use the toilet, and then hopefully we will be done with cooking breakfast by then. And she also wants to go ice skating from winter season, so I'm going to lock that one in. Because there is a ice rink over here. We did use it in the last part. That's one thing I remember. Um, so, yep. Yeah, and we are done with breakfast so grab a serving Kyoko come grab a serving and they will have a lovely little discussion for bre uh, breakfast hopefully and she's upset about being cold go sit go sit in on the komatsu table is it komatsu hang on I don't want to get it wrong that was one of the things I remember being so terrified about getting things wrong because obviously, I'm not Japanese. So, Kotatsu table, okay. Lovely, okay. Just come and, no, you're done with that? Okay. So let's go enter in the lottery. So I believe it's just under household, purchase a lottery ticket. Yep, and come purchase a lottery ticket. Nope, not purchase gifts. Purchase a lottery ticket. Maybe we'll win. I don't know. Um, oh, yes. So the draw occurs tomorrow morning. So I don't know if you have to watch TV. We don't own a TV. So. <laughs> could be interesting. So with Chiyoko today. I might ha have her try and become a bit more emotionally mindful. Maybe I'll send her on a hike when Kyoko's at work. She needs to reach level 3 of the writing skill. So, water shut off day is now in effect in accordance with the water conservation nap. All water will be turned off for the next 12 hours. Hell no! 
I don't remember caring about that. Can I turn off naps? I don't actually remember. Because they are the most annoying thing ever. Um, gameplay. Pack settings. Eco lifestyle. No, it's just enable NPC voting. So you can't actually turn them off. Oh yeah, this. Uh, the Sim Sessions exclusive music festival has come to town for a limited time featuring BB Rexa performing an acoustic rendition of Sabotage with the additional performances of Glass Animals and Joy Oladakun. Uh, it's sure to be the summer hit. Head over to Magnolia Blossom Park in Willow Creek to attend every Sunday at 12pm. Well, it's currently winter, so it's not summer. So where is our mailbox? I would like to repeal every single nap that is here because this is very these are very annoying and I've had enough of the naps so thank you so oh here's Hayashi has he come to visit uh, let's sweat what are our, oh yes he can like fitness I guess so where is the hiking sign oh she they're actually they could go on a hike actually over here, I think. Is this the hiking sign? No, that's just the... Okay. Where is the hiking route? I don't exactly know. She is very brave. Emi Sasaki. Very brave. Okay. Snow. Obviously, it's a mountain town. So the whole world is focused around the mountain. But I mean, the even just like the regular neighborhoods are just so pretty in all the seasons. I've I haven't really oh. seen it in autumn, but I'm sure oh. it again is very nice. That? Oh my god, she she really needs to be okay. But anyway, so we have a state yeah. of tranquility from the natural surroundings. Oh, the serenity of this oh. area fills you up with complete tranquility. So over that way is the graveyard. Oh, and we appear to be going that way now. Yep, she's fallen over again. It's okay. So, okay, no, Sean, go away. So she's going to take some deep breaths and continue along her little route. You know, maybe she's just thinking about how she... Maybe doesn't have the longest time left. And she wants to see her children be very successful. And she hopes that Kyoko ends up marrying her hopefully soon to be boyfriend. Uh, go for, I'm going to have her go write a wish. Why is she tense? Not a pleasant hike. From going on a terrible hike, staying at home would have been a much better use of time today. Oh, I am so sorry, Kyoko. But go write yourself a little wish over here. Hopefully it will come true. Uh, go <sighs> view them and then go take a picture. Maybe she'll show Kyoko later on. She's also sad. Some, some wishes never come Ooh. true. Not every wish can be granted. Oh, that's sad. So there's a little like... Oh, she can go take a little rest over here. So hopefully she can make it over there without falling. Please be very careful. There's this nice little hut over here with just some benches that she can just sit and reflect in. That's actually like really cute. I didn't even know that was there. So we've kind of done the whole trail over this way. So there is like a mountain shrine over here, but let's head back to, oh wait, are we, oh we've, hang on, wait, where did we start? Oh, we walked quite a long way. So let's, let's go back over to the center over here. So. Hopefully she won't slay. Oh my god, she did. Chioko, I am so sorry. Oh, I think Eliza Pancakes just slipped. Oh, it wasn't Eliza. It was a girl named Angel. Okay. 
But anyway, <laughs> I'll send her back down there. She really needs to pee. I believe there are some toilets. Oh yeah, go go piss, girl. Go piss. You can do it. <laughs> go pee, girl. Nice. Don't talk to the random lady. Go to the toilet. And why is Jeffrey like... Okay, Jeffrey... Okay. I'm not gonna comment on that. Oh, and there's an alien over here. This is like the only alien I've seen in The Sims in a very long time. Kenji. Hmm. Alright then. So is there a ice rink over here somewhere? I feel like there should be. Because there normally is one in every world. But I can't see it. I guess um, there might not be actually. Because there's one in our neighbourhood. Because I would like to send her skiing. Or ice skating. Okay, so she's just talking to Kiyoshi. That's fine. There are like so many kids. So there's Nanami, Taku, and Gabe. Hi, Gabe. <laughs> Alright, let's go home. I think Chiyoko's had enough of nature. You know, it didn't really do her well. There was a naked child, and I think that was the other child from the Akimatsu family. Um, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna question it because I'm not gonna question it. And we are back home. And because she wants to go ice skating, I am gonna send her over to the rink over here. And she can come skate around, and she she can slip all she wants. But there we go. So she she's fulfilling her whim of going ice skating. She's not very good at staying stable on land or on the ice. So uh, is there? You know what? Let's go put. Let's go do some simmies because this is like one of the only collectibles in the game. So, let's hope the vending machine doesn't get stuck. There we go. Okay, so let's see which simmy we get. And we got Jasmine Holiday. All right. So, let me look at collections. How many simmies are there? Um, so, there are 12 and we have one. So, let's Let's buy a bunch of simmies. Oh. And hopefully none of them get stuck. So, Miss Train Home, Kyoko is doing the right thing and staying late to finish up a last minute influx of non-critical form 84Bs. That does mean she missed the train home and has to figure out what to do next. Sh uh, should she call the rideshare home or rest up in a capsule hotel while waiting for the late train? Let's get a rideshare. So, needs to call a car and it doing search pricing she gets home but the cost of a few Somalians. okay oh no we got the vending machine was stuck come on okay this is very dangerous oh, there we go lovely purchase another one let's open the one that got stuck so let's see and we got old gabby let's open this one we got Yamachan. Let's open this one. Let's just keep buying them basically until we get new ones. Oh, we got another old Gabby. Open this one. And we got another Yamachan. And she is angry. Oh. Open Simi. And we got a buddy. So we have three unique ones. Oh, we have four, I mean. So we can sell one of the old Gabbies. And one of the Yamachans. Okay. Go home. Head. Yes, she's already heading home. I need to have her kind of just relax a bit because, I mean, she has pushed herself a lot today. Go take a nice bath. And Kyoko's come home and gone straight to bed but it's the wrong bed so I need to put her in the right one 
And let's display our simmies over here. Lovely. Oh, and we have the sim sessions ticket that we can hang on the wall, which is quite cool, but I'm just going to keep it in her inventory. And I don't know why she's still sad about... Oh, she's very lonely because of low social. Uh, she can call her son. So chat with Kaito. And she can have a phone conversation with him, which hopefully will improve her mood. So there we go. She's feeling much better from having talked to someone, and I'm going to send her to bed for the night. And that's where I'm going to end the part. I've been recording for about like half an hour. I've been recording for about an hour. So I've really had fun coming back to Snowy Escape after all this time. Um... I don't really know how many parts I'm going to do. I, I originally set out to do about eight. And I think I'll do that many. So this is the third part. So... So, I, I, so there's like five more parts that I'm going to do. And hopefully that will all be done before Cottage Living comes out. I'm also taking a break from The Sims 2. So I'll be able to get that out and done pretty quickly hopefully over the next few weeks so anyway i hope you really enjoyed coming back to snowy escape after so long i know i have it's a really fun expansion so it's going to be fun to play again because we've got all of this we have to see some festivals and then all of the uh, mountain climbing stuff, which we are going to do with Kyoko and Hayashi. Because I have a very cute idea for what I want to do at the top of the mountain. So, that needs to happen. <clears throat> anyway though, if you haven't already, make sure to leave a like and subscribe. Check out my other Let's Plays. Obviously, right now this is the only one that's running. But, I will be starting The Sims 2 up again. I need to just finish the neighbourhood that I'm working on for pets. Because I'm making my own neighbourhood for pets. Because there isn't a fourth neighbourhood. So I need to finish it. But definitely go ahead and check out my other Sims 4 series that I've done. I've done Eco Lifestyle, Dream Home Decorator, Paranormal and Snowy Escape. And of course I will be doing Cottage Living when that comes out. And I have some more fun series planned in the future of... The two Sims games that I currently am not playing on my channel. So, work that out. I mean mainline PC Sims game. I don't mean like the console versions or the handheld versions. So, the Sims 1 and 3, basically, in the future I'm planning of doing those. So, without further ado, I hope you really... I hope you enjoy the rest of your day wherever you are. And I will see you in the next video. Bye, everyone.